a little definition about what Swap C is. So it stands for size, weight, and power. And many times people put C at the end, which is cost, which is uh, very important. So from a size perspective, uh, we believe that our devices are some of the smallest in the world, but yet also allow us to be able to spread the heat out. So there's a lot of different ways to do that, and we have um, techniques of being able to do that. And of course, the weight part of it these devices are very small, they don't weigh a lot, but one of the things is to be able to use surface mount type packages. Surface mount packaging uh, is much, much lighter than having to use flange type packages. And we've come up with a technology to be able to attach um, Ganon silicon carbide directly to copper and the thermal uh, conductivity is very similar for that joint between the two of that of uh, gold tin solder but yet it's not gold tin solder. It's a very proprietary process. And that's one of the things that we bring to the marketplace. And that's why our customers will, will see um, in our catalogs, they'll see 50 watt, 100 watt parts that under pulse conditions, we can put those in a surface mount package and work with our systems uh, customers to attach those to a board and still be able to pull the heat out. So it does a couple of different things. It saves a lot of size in their systems. It um, saves a lot of weight. And it also means that they can use standard surface mount type board shops to be able to assemble these parts onto their boards. Um, and from a cost perspective, of course, everything is about how many square millimeters that you consume on a wafer. So the more parts we can put on a wafer, um, the lower the cost and that cost we can pass on to our customers.